You must understand that in the past, our grand-grandfather wasn't a big wine producer, but they are farmers. So for them, have different kind of grapes, make them sure to have uh, some kind of production. They are sure that, for example, if you start uh, to make the harvest and uh, the weather starts to run, you have in your home Barbera, that is the first one we can measure. You are uh, Stefano Melchiodi. No, yes, Stefano Melchiodi. Managing He's... director of uh, the estate. Okay. He is uh, the sorry managing director, managing of director the... of the farming estate, and he will explain to us what we are gonna see here as vineyards and uh, what is the main aim of our farming estate. Okay, ripeti i dati perché adesso ci andiamo tutti. Piccola azienda dell'Utropo Pavese, parte ovest, Castellano, di proprietà della famiglia Bragiotti dal 1980. So this is a small farming estate in the western part of Oltrepo Pavese, in the area around the, the small town of Casteggio and it is owned by family Bragiotti since 1980s. Azienda acquistata inizialmente come punto di incontro di una famiglia molto numerosa, eh, il fondatore però Enrico Bragiotti, molto appassionato di vino, ci ha messo poco a trasformarla in un'azienda vitivinicola. So it was firstly the meeting point of a very numerous and huge family, but the founder which was sorry, Enrico Bragiotti, Enrico Bragiotti uh, then transformed it uh, into a farming estate essentially for the production as you can see of wines, so of grapes. Oggi la famiglia Bragiotti è composta da 41 persone wow. <laughs> e all'ultima cena di Natale erano tutte qui a cena okay. insieme ad Enrico che ha 96 anni. Okay. So uh, today the family is composed by 41 persons and uh, last Christmas they were all here to have their big Christmas lunch all 41 with the founder Enrico Bragiotti which is 96 uh, yeah. nowadays. Okay. E quindi il punto di incontro ha funzionato. Okay. So the meeting point was good. 